Hey there, long time no see. Huh? This is a paper. And this is uh, uh, made with uh, toothpaste, detergent, soap, and water, ethanol, and peroxide H2O2. Uh, this is uh, in a solid state. Uh, because it, uh, it has been rainy season, uh, it has taken several days, uh, no, maybe about two weeks <laughs> to make it dry. Mm -hmm. uh, this is just one layer. Hmm. <clears throat> uh, soap is in a solid state, so to make the soap to make the soap into liquid state, uh, I use the peroxide. H2O2 uh, This is the battery uh, Just one layer. Uh, I I think I made this battery about a month year uh, a month ago a month ago a month or two months ago, I'm not sure, uh, but this battery still works very well. By the way, it's, uh, yeah, insulation is good, and then its uh, initial voltage is just 1.1 volt, but slowly, slowly drops. Okay, let's charge this battery about 20, uh, 20 minutes. Ah, pressure, pressure, pressure. My goal, my goal is to make it uh, initial voltage uh, three volt. But, it, but this is that's not easy because uh, because because this is not a perfect sodium ion. Mm. By using uh, sodium hydroxide. Uh, uh, I tried to make a solid state battery by using uh, sodium hydroxide, but uh, it didn't work to me. So I keep using detergent and toothpaste. Okay, see you after 20 minutes. Uh, and uh, one thing, if you want to know about how to make uh, graphene sheet, graphene uh, graphene plate. Uh, look, uh, watch my pre uh, watch my previous videos. Uh, there is a uh, good information about binder. Okay, see you then. See you after twenty minutes. Okay, twenty minutes has passed. Mm. Uh, without pre uh, with pressure. It's uh, just two point eight volt. Hey.
maybe doing experiment without soap is better. Uh, is better because uh, soap has uh, there is a fat in the soap, so it can be a resistance. Uh, doing experiment without soap. It, uh, I think doing experiment without soap is better. Uh, in the next experiment, uh, uh, this is uh, peroxide and iron oxide. I'll try this again. Uh huh. Maybe one year ago, one year ago, about one year ago, I I tried to make a battery by using iron oxide uh, it worked well maybe i will do the experiment again hmm. oh Just 2.4 volt. <laughs> Can you see that the voltage increases? Twenty-six, twenty-seven. <laughs> it increases. What happened? Yeah. Uh, this is the battery uh, maybe I made a month ago. Let's charge this battery again. This is also paper. Yeah, paper electrode is good. But how can I reach 3.0 volt in initial state? How can I? Now, it stopped, it, it stopped at 2.4 volt, but because its uh, initial voltage was 1.1 volt, uh, the voltage will return to 1.1 volt in in a few days that's the problem uh, i must make each initial voltage 3.1 volt It works. It works very well. Aha. Uh, yeah. hmm. uh -huh. I can take a picture in this state.
Can you see that? If I charge this battery more, maybe it would reach a much higher voltage. And there is no damage on aluminum plate. It, it means this is a perfect solid, uh, this is a perfect rechargeable solid state battery. One, just one more difficulty. Reaching 3.0 volt in initial state, initial stage. Hmm, I will not give it up. Uh, by the way, uh, I watched the news uh, uh, about too much help, uh, too much rain in Europe. I hope they can recover uh, as soon as possible. Okay, have a nice day.